let's uh, break this baby down. Um, that solo was just something I just came up with um, off the top of my head. Sorry if it sucked. Uh, anyways, uh, so we're going to start off with the intro section. Um, there's one guitar going. We're, we're in drop D, so it's just playing the top two strings. That's going. See, there's a bunch, a, def, a bunch of different guitar parts going on. So, anyways, um, now we'll go through the main part. So we're gonna start on a D note, and then we're playing the octave. So we're gonna skip the string and then come down uh, two strings from that D, and that's an octave there. So we're gonna start off with one, one, two. Then we're gonna slide up to the F, which is on the eighth fret. So we're going down, up, down, and then coming up to G, and we're going to hit that on an upswing. So we got, and then we're going to do the same thing again, but instead of going to G, we'll go back down to D. And then we'll repeat it again. Then we get into the main riff. The main riff is also the same as the verse. The only difference is uh, when we're doing the main riff, we're playing the top two strings. Um, wide open. Uh, when we're doing the verse, we're just going to pawn you the top string and play the same notes. Okay, so now the frets we're going to be using are 3 and 4, 6 and 7, 10, 6 and 7 on the way down, 5, back to 3 and 4, but we're going to slide it. Okay, we're going to play an open top two strings every time before we play a fretted note. So it's going to go. section, same thing, open note before each fretted note, but palm muted and only one string this time. Okay, and at the end, we're going to hit that slide. Now every fourth time, uh, one guitar is going to go to the D string and play the exact same notes. Okay, now during the chorus section, it's going to go D, which is the fifth fret on your A string, just a regular power chord, then C, then B, then back to C. While that's going on, the other guitar is going and matching every uh, note on the way down. Now when we go to that C on the way back, we're going to hit our top string open as well. Okay, so that gives us some dissonance there. Um, and then we got the uh, solo section. Just before the solo section, after the second chorus, which is a double chorus, it's just going to hit the top two strings open. <laughs> it's going to last for a bunch of beats, and then the solo section kicks in. Now the the, ver the um, rhythm guitar for the solo section is D, C, B, and then back to D. So that goes back into the main riff, then a double chorus, and then it finishes off with it. Okay, so those are all the main parts. You can figure out how many times you play each one. It's not very difficult. Um, if you have any questions, please feel free to um, send me an email or a message, subscribe, um, anything would be cool. Uh, thanks for watching. Appreciate it.